Hey, Paula. Meet me at the party. Niggas ain't do what we did, bro. We had niggas dressing like us. Them niggas were dressing like us, too. Hey. You feel what I'm saying? So how can, you know what I'm saying? We inspired the world in a different way. You know what I'm saying? Pop your and shit. Sh- and shout out to that boy Hollywood, Buck. I, I, I watched that interview, bro. You know, you, you one of the top shows I watch. You feel what I'm saying? And nigga said some real nigga shit. Nigga, we created a whole nother goddamn title in the motherfucking goddamn industry. Genre? You know genre. They, they gave us our own genre. Like real shit. Snout, goddamn. Like real shit. And it's a lot of niggas came before us. Way better than us. We ain't the best rappers, but niggas ain't do that. Facts. Facts. Niggas was, ain't do that. Nah, facts. Niggas was rapping before us. Niggas was making beats before us. Why did it take when 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 we came out for everybody to say, this is what I want to do now? We inspired that shit, bro. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? And what niggas don't know, this shit really got down. We had the college got down popping first. Before we even got here. Before we even came back. Hey. You feel what I'm saying? Fuck, fucking up talent shows. Got all these niggas riding around playing our shit. Nigga, like real shit, my nigga. All the HBCUs. You feel what I'm saying? And like, that shit just crazy because like a, a lot of niggas don't know, like, this man right here inspired me to goddamn really goddamn do this shit too. We inspired each other. You feel what I'm saying? And shit, when Alan Temple was fucking with Born Home, nigga, I, I had to walk through... Remember that shit? Walk through Born Home to look for your ass because this nigga running around that motherfucker trapping like a motherfucker. Yeah, I'm yeah. trying to get this nigga to go to the shows, come to the studio. <laughs> this nigga be like, boy, hold up, I'll be right back. back. <laughs> it's Friend, don't back, know that boy. I'm gone, boy. I'm not finna go nowhere. Real shit. I remember that the first time I really met Shouted Low because I walked through that motherfucker looking for your ass. That nigga would approach me like, bro, who, goddamn, who, you, who you is, nigga? I'm, like, I'm looking for goddamn Pale. Another nigga like, oh, he looking for poop. He look for poo. Oh, that nigga around now. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, that, that nigga low. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, yeah, bro. Like this shit, like niggas don't know then what made us a perfect motherfucking combination because I was fired with this business shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You, you did, remember, you like, I remember goddamn, we cut school, my nigga, and we were going to my apartment. I rem- okay, okay, listen, yeah. let's break it down. I, say, I remember this shit. Mama in prison now. All right, so listen. All right, so we had Doug. We had Doug at school. All right, I used to sell weed. All right, whole high school. I'm, right. I'm bunking, selling right. weed. Everybody said they had to bear weed around that motherfucker, and I was kind of like the go-to person for like street shit. I was like, I was cool. You know what I'm saying? So Pimp was like, Pimp would say, "Come on, okay." In tenth grade, I did, a, I did, a, I did a, a poem called Money, and the shit went crazy around the whole school. Mm-hmm. So now, and then. Everybody was kept trying to get me to do music. You know what I'm saying? So Pimp was like, shit, hey man, got down on uh, uh, come on to the goddamn uh, to the uh, pot, man. I got the studio and shit in that motherfucker. I said, only way I go if you buy some weed for me. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Goddamn pimp buy the weed. We get in here. What kind of car you had to kill? I had to kill. He had to kill. kill Black with, with the beat of that with motherfucker. The, that nigga had the house speaker. Remember the, the real house speaker with the wood box. He had the house speaker with the wood box in that motherfucking trunk on the app. Cause a nigga fight with that technology, bro. Like, <clears throat> I still I got them just fucking fucking around shit, breaking shit apart, just figuring shit out. Then I figured that shit out. So nigga, I had rig my motherfucking car, had the whole motherfucking <laughs> house shit in that motherfucker. I'm like, but that house shit be hard as a motherfucker. Yeah, I'm gonna did. put this shit in the trunk. You yeah, feel what I'm saying? About- <laughs> and, but I ain't gonna never open my trunk for nobody. You feel what I'm saying? And shit, yeah, man, we got boom. That so we go on. that motherfucker. I go on that bitch. You go on the temp. So when you go in the tent, you in the first parking lot to the right, pimp got the apartment downstairs. This is during school hours, all right? Yep. So I walk in that motherfucker first time, walking that bitch. Soon as you walk in that motherfucker, you see a desk. Soon as you come in the apartment, you see a desk. And it's a nigga sitting at the desk. My homie nut. Shout out Lil' Tony. Tony sitting in the motherfucker desk. Goddamn, them niggas doing all the phones. Pimp wireless. Pimp and wireless. Goddamn, you want some phone, you want some <laughs> neck tail, want anything, you hook your shit up, uh, wipe this motherfucker clean, all that shit right there. And they got it going. So Pimp be there saying, playing the whole business, shit. motherfucker running facts. while I'm at school. You know what I'm saying? Nah, facts. Nah, that was well, I got to tell him what I would do. Like, I had the whole hood with my shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, motherfucker got there, come get a phone. It was basically like a burner, nigga. When that motherfucker cut off, nigga, you come feel the paperwork. I got niggas that are filling out paperwork. <laughs> Show did. There, like, <laughs> Show did. Get new phone, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. real nigga shit. Like, get money out of this shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I was the first one with the two ways, nigga. 